All right, eight-year-old Jack Russell Terrier barking at people coming to the house. Let's fix this. Let's excited again. Just get her attention back to you, you know? Okay. What's important is you practice this. Okay. So it becomes normal, like a normal habit for her. Right now, go ahead. Like when my son comes over? Yep. Have him sit in the car like this to like get her under control? Exactly, yeah. Okay. Yep. But then you guys practice this with each other because it's it's the repetition yep. that everyone gets good at it. Okay. Just like that, yeah. What a good girl. Yeah. And then like the next step is I'll get out of the car and then you got to get her under control again. Okay. Think of it like that. Cause so stop feeding her for a moment and let's see what does she, what's her choice. Does she pay attention to mom? Which she is, she's hanging out with you. Or does she be like, you know what? There's a threat. Let me go check that out. Okay. You know? Good girl. Yeah, exactly. Good girl, Maya. Yeah. So she's good right now. And then, but that's better. She didn't, she didn't truck. <laughs> She didn't charge at first. And you keep diffusing this, yep. Good girl. Yeah. Yep. What a good girl. Another thing too, just seeing how your neighborhood is. Perfect example, the two dogs walking by. Does she bark at them too? Barks at everything. Yeah, so with that, same thing. Get her attention on you as that's going by. That's what we need to practice with her. It's, it's showing her like, how you want her to act in this new environment with you. Like I was telling you on the phone, Maya. you just rescued her. Yep. It's still new for her, even oh, though it's been yet. a couple months, it's still very new, you know? And the way she could have been like this for years in her old home. We don't know that. We, yep. yeah, we you know, you don't, you never know that. But the thing about rescue dogs is you can change that. They just need time, they need to adjust. But then it's now teaching them and not letting them get away with it. Think of it like that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm no big deal. And she needs to understand that. She understands that through the actions she does by you reinforcing them. She's doing good right now. You're giving her affection. You're praising her. Good girl. This is how we want her to act. But then if I come closer, this is where you'd probably have to pick up the leash again because we, we know what she can do. Right. Our goal is to get this again. See how she's now settled? Yeah. It's taken a little bit, but this is how she needs to get comfortable in this environment. So just grab the leash, because now I'm gonna walk a little forward and you just hang there with her. Okay. Let her. Let her just settle again, like, you know, let her relax. But then, uh, and this is like what I'm talking about, like action. So I walk forward. No. Get it, yep. And you get her attention. No. And now, see if you get her attention with the food. Because she's now just like in a bark. Yeah. We have to get that, the redirect back to you. Good girl. And I'll try that again. No. Yep. You get her calm, have her be calm. Yeah. So let it happen off of like when she does something. So that is just a simple no. She barks as no. But then you just want to use her name no. if she loses it. Okay. No. No. Does she know sit? So now we're going to do, we're going to replace that no with a good word. Because you don't want to be saying no, no, no. She's like, what am I doing wrong? You want her to be rewarded with the right behavior. So if she's not barking at me, wait for her not to bark. I want you to then say yes and give her a treat. Choice is hanging out with you. But when she looks at me, what's her choice? You need to catch that moment now. If she's looking at me, she's not barking, reward her. You're going to say yes first. Then you grab the treat. That yes is telling her, you're doing the right thing, girl. Keep it up. Here's a reward for it. Yeah. Just like that. Perfect.
See how she looked at me? Yep. Yep. We just got to diffuse this. Yeah. And you'll get her attention right away because I moved closer. Get her attention. Yeah. So it's now her name to get her back to you. Okay. And then if she's doing good, you just say yes. That's a yes. 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 Good girl. There you go. Yes. Yes. This is what I talk about is bonding. You're training. You're spending time with your dog. You're teaching them how you want them to act. And I want you to reward her again. Give her a couple treats. Because if we only give her like one reward, it's not worth her while. Okay. Give her a bunch so she's like, you know what? He's not even that important anymore. Good. And it's like, you dictate, do you want her to bark at me? No, so get her attention. Now you know how to get her attention. See, this is how she wants to be. She just doesn't know how to be when she gets frustrated. They get frustrated when they get stressed, you know? And she's communicating. She's like, I don't like, I don't know who this guy is. Maya. I feed her again. Give her like three to five every time you call her. Trust me, it's... it's... Good girl. Yeah, and this hang out, relax, and just let her settle. Let's let her get calm now and relax. And then the big thing too, it's like, we always feel, ner we always feel nervous in these situations. And that's like, when you can work through it, you get comfortable and then you start feeling confident that you can now do this, you know? Let's go is a universal word we use okay. to just redirect the other way. Okay. So you can be like, let's go and just walk inside. The moment's over. It just, it happens like that. They live in the moment. They don't dwell. They, they're in the moment. The moment's over. Okay. Let's go have your seat. And now reward her. Because now it's like, I'm here. You brought her into the environment. She's a lot more calmer. You know, wow. she might lose it again. That's fine. This is what you're going to work on. But this might be something, too, we practice. So she put her inside. I'm going to pull out, circle around, come back in. You two hang out here. Okay. You'll see, we'll recreate this moment, and then you'll get her and bring her out. Okay. Because now we're showing her, no, you're going to be good while, while you come greet this person. No. Just like okay. that. That's good. Perfect. Let's go. Yep. Let's go. And I think what was good too is. Alright, we're gonna practice everything we've been working on in this lesson now. Here we go. So it's him again. Mm. Yeah. So you can go get her under control, you know, because this is gonna be the next thing we work on is that stopping. And it stops as soon as you get up. Like, these are great signs, you know, yeah. like. Now we just got to communicate with her a little better. Huh? I just, you know, at the same time, I don't want her to really just stop barking when somebody comes in to let us know somebody's here. At the same time, the viciousness, though, is... Exactly, yeah. We don't want her to escalate, you know. So thank you for the, the initial warning. Thank you for letting me know somebody's here. But now you got to stop. Yeah, exactly. You know? That's what we want. Exactly. Good puppy. Yeah. Yes, you are. Good girl. Now I just say, give her a treat for being good. You can say yes, because she's good. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And this is the thing too. Look at her. Like, and I'll get closer, but 
She's tired. Yep. Yeah. You mentally worked her in this training session that okay. she's never been worked like that in a while. Okay. Now you start chipping away at this every day because she has so much energy. She starts the day. You guys are doing your play. That's great. But we need... She's falling asleep. <laughs> your dog was barking at the door at people going by. Now we worked her. And she... There's a little wolf, but now she's falling asleep at the door. This is the, the results of what we just got to do every day. Okay. That's why I said, what do you do with her in the breakfast and dinner? You replace it with training sessions now. Okay. Tires her out more. You can do this throughout the day too. But okay. a good five minutes in the morning, five minutes in the evening with her. She's, she's tired. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. And that's what it's about at the end of the day. Just helping owners get results with their dog. This was an eight-year-old Jack Russell. They just adopted her two months ago. And it's just showing them how they can get results and build a better relationship for the rest of their life with this dog. It's companionship they want.